Hi, welcome to this tutorial on Aegis UK, and we welcome you on board. In this tutorial, we're going to cover the basic search functions of our platform. Once you log into Aegis, you'll come to this page of special offers from our vendor partners and distributor partners. And just a quick note, we're actually blurring out all of our distributor trade prices throughout the tutorial, as these are real purchase prices from distribution. If you're interested in any of these products, let's say you're interested in the 64 gig Freecom data bar here, you of course click on it to access the product page. Now down here, you can see the various distributors that offer it, the price, the quantity in stock, and the product specifications directly from CNET, the industry leader, or from IceCat. And you can click on the image here to access the entire gallery of images for the product. But let's say you're looking for a specific item. Let's go back here and use the search function, which is very powerful. It uses the Oracle backend database. So let's say we're looking for some HP ink toner. We'll use the CC364A. Now this brings us to all of these toners that are available from our distributor partners. Now the first thing you're going to want to do is come down here to this panel and click the globe icon. This goes straight to the distributor and brings you back real-time pricing and availability for your individual account. So let's click and we go straight to the distributor's back-end system with real-time price and stock information. We've got purchase price, quantity, and up over here we've got the turnover rate. This is how a particular product is selling within its category. So, for instance, suppose we're looking at 19-inch monitors. Within the LCD monitors category, this product ranks number 40, with 0.4% of all sales, while this monitor performs at number 1, with 9% of all sales. And, of course, you can filter all of these searches. You can filter by minimum price, maximum price. You can restrict the search to products that are only currently in stock or by products that are active, in which a distributor has given a live feed within the last five days. You can also tick this box here, which will reveal the purchase price for all products. And of course you can then order it by price. If the value is in black, it means the product is in stock, and these red values indicate that the product is out of stock. So again, you can restrict these search results to products that are in stock only, by ticking the Restrict to Stocked Products box and clicking the Search button again. That's it for the basic search functions of the Aegis site. Thanks for listening, and we hope this has been helpful. Be sure to watch the next tutorials. We'll be covering advanced search functions, ordering, and master data and administration.